A very warm welcome. You're watching Diaspora Colors. I am Hortensia Mushai. I am delighted to have an amazing and phenomenal woman in studio with me today. She is an award winner, the president of Burkina Faso's Baka Baka that is based in Vienna and also a representative of the Burkina Faso diaspora in seven European countries. Welcome to the studio, Irene Hochhauer-Pola. Thank you, Hortensia, for the invitation. It is such a pleasure having you here today. And thank you for gracing our studios as always. Thank we are going to jump straight in. You are the recipient of the Prosi Award Excellence 2019. Tell us about it. Did you expect this award? No, it was really unexpected. We start working uh, in our project uh, uh, for Burkina Faso for children for school. Um, 2007, uh, we, we uh, founded the association Barka Barka. And uh, yeah, keep on going, uh, helping people. And we saw also uh, uh, some results. Uh, women who, which are, who are empower, empowered and uh, children going uh, to school. Uh, what they did not, uh, uh, what they could not do because of uh, lack of money, and uh, yeah, I was really surprised uh, to 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 hear that uh, I have been nominated to have this award. So, right. yeah. And how long has uh, this award been there for Prosi? I think uh, award uh, Prosi Excellent Award uh, started with the festival. You know, there is every year uh, uh, a festival, a Prosi festival. And uh, this idea came to, to award, to give an award to somebody, a personality uh, which have been doing some good projects for other communities uh, who have been uh, helping other people. Yeah. Right. And Baka Baka, can you give us just a summary of, of this organization, how you started, where you started it, and where you are right now? Mm -hmm. Baka Baka means uh, uh, thank you, thank you in uh, the Dagara language. And uh, as I said, uh, we started 2007. Uh, it's uh, in the uh, southwest of Burkina Faso. Uh, we have like uh, 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 two parts of the association. One is here in Austria and the other one is in Burkina Faso because we are working with the idea that uh, we are not bringing the fish to the people, but we are learning to the people how to fish. Mm -hmm. So they have uh, also uh, a part of the association uh, there. Uh, and their role is to realize uh, concretely the project. So we think about the project here, we look for the, the, the founding here, and then they take then, uh, the role for of real, realize, realizing the project. Because they know better than us here what are their needs. So uh, we have um, realized a uh, um, project, uh, a well project for water for the, the village, for, for Roteon. Uh, we also uh, help uh, uh, a school, a uh, free uh, classes school, to have uh, school material like a school bank, etc. And uh, we also uh, uh, organize every year a Christmas fest for the children where we give them some kits like uh, mosquito nets uh, or some uh, hygienic uh, kits, uh, um, soap. You know, something that, uh, that is uh, here like uh, ele elementary, but there it's very necessary. So, and we, we see every year how uh, children, how their eyes are smiling. And this is for us, um, yeah, the, the big award, let's say. Yeah. And um, having started this uh, organization, how has the response been from the community here in Vienna? How has the support been? I must say that uh, the support is not like uh, uh, what I have been, uh, uh, how to say, uh, expecting. Uh, but uh, you know, it's um, uh, a lot of people have their association, and this is what happened in the diaspora here. Yeah. And then uh, everybody is concentrated in his association. There are uh, um, a, 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 a not so much uh, interaction. What we need because we need to. Uh, share our experiences. We need to to see how we manage a project uh, 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 in in Africa, and to learn from each other. 
So I have more interaction with Austrian uh, people uh, who are interested uh, to see because some also uh, are um, doing projects uh, in Burkina Faso or have uh, heard about a, a project in Burkina Faso and they are interested ah, because Burkina Faso is a focus land uh, of, of uh, Austrian uh, development pol policy. So uh, I have more interaction with the Austrian people. Mm -hmm. But I would like, I would love to have more interaction yeah, with uh, African diaspora. Right. Now, you have not only done uh, Baka Baka as your organization. Like I introduced you, you're a woman who wears many hats. One of them being the representative of the Burkina Faso diaspora of seven European countries. Tell us more about this and which European countries specifically. Mm -hmm. uh, it is like this, uh, in Burkina Faso, the, the government uh, uh, have seen the role of the, the diaspora in the development of the country very early. And uh, there is a, a ministry, uh, we call, uh, call it a ministry of the diaspora, Burkina Bay diaspora. And uh, this ministry have uh, organized uh, a forum last year and uh, uh, for every zone, every, every country, there is uh, one person who is, or two or three, it depends on the, um, of the uh, how to say, uh, if the country is big. The, so they organize an election to choose these people to represent all the people from Burkina Faso living in these countries. So for uh, Austria, for example, because uh, the embassy is covering uh, uh, seven countries, this is uh, Austria, this is uh, Slovenia, Serbia, Hungary, uh, Czech Republic, uh, and we have also uh, Croatia, and uh, all these uh, uh, countries, you have Burkina Bay there. Mm -hmm. So uh, I am in charge to make the link, link, link uh, between them and the, the, the ministry uh, in Burkina Faso. All right. And on top of that, you are also a representative of the delegates of Burkina Bay yeah. in, in Europe, shall I say. Can you tell us more mm -hmm. about that? Mm -hmm. So uh, after the, the forum, uh, we had the recommendations, you know, because uh, uh, um, um, the topic was how to contribute to the development uh, uh, of Burkina Faso. So all the delegates there uh, made, made a recommendation and then we built a committee to, uh, to, 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 to follow uh, the application of this uh, this uh, recommendation because you know sometimes in our countries uh, you make uh, forums a lot of you spend a lot of money and then there is uh, no um, follow up so uh, for us it was very important and also for the minister of uh, Burkina Bay in in, in uh, abroad so it was uh, very important that we get uh, a, um, a committee to speak uh, think about what, uh, how to ap uh, apply this recommendation. And uh, so uh, the, comp the committee is composed of uh, one person represented one zone, one region. Uh, we have uh, 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 America, we have uh, Asian, we have Africa, we have Europe and, uh, and so on. And then uh, I have been elected to represent all the delegated uh, uh, from Europe. Amazing. I have no words because, you know, I, when I came into the country, you're among the first African women that I met here and to see your growth because I have witnessed it and to see, you know, the steps that you keep on making. It is such an inspiration. It is really, really inspiring. And um, you are not only doing that again, a woman of many hearts, you're the project manager for VIDC. Yes. Tell us about that. VIDC is the Vienna uh, Institute for International Dialogue and Cooperation, and uh, it is uh, one of the the the, the eldest uh, um, development cooperation uh, organization in Austria uh, that was founded from uh, Bruno Kraski. Yeah, and uh, we have uh, a lot of uh, we organize uh, a lot of conferences, uh, a lot of panel discussion, workshop. Uh, and we are focusing in regional and also in topic like uh, uh, African, African uh, topic uh, we had like, uh, um, uh, 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 how to say, uh, we, we try to see how Africa can uh, develop and also how uh, the, 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 the view, the European view in Africa have to be, to be changed so that we get a, a better relationship with uh, Africa and, and Europe. 
We have also uh, uh, conferences, topic with Turkey, uh, 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 yeah, and the politics there, how uh, people um, are, are doing, uh, uh, what is v very important is that we are not in the mainstream, yeah. We try to take uh, some expert to uh, speak about a problem in the country or in the region so that uh, we have really the, uh, the, the view of the, the real view, not the political view or, right yes. Right yeah. on the ground. Yes, so we have also a topic uh, with Palestine, Palestine. We have also economic topic. Uh, last time we had uh, a conference uh, uh, based on uh, uh, China in, uh, in, in Africa. Africa. Africa, yes, Africa. yes. Mm -hmm. And this is uh, every time we have a lot of people coming to, to assist, uh, to participate to these uh, conferences. All right, and uh, I would want to believe that it takes a woman with a vision and a mission to be involved in all these things because it is not an easy task. Mm -hmm. It is great to have the titles and it is great to have the awards, but I believe that you have to have that will. There has to be something in you that pushes you to want to do this. What is it? Yeah, this is a very good question. I think uh, it's come from my education and also because uh, my father is a very engaged person. So I learned from him uh, because um, his philosophy is you have to change things where you are and uh, w what you are doing, if you cannot do it better, so leave it. And uh, you have to be motivated to give uh, other people something uh, that can uh, help them to have a better life. And uh, I've learned that uh, uh, as I was a child to, 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 to be motivated, to be engaged for other people. Uh, because uh, for me, uh, life is not uh, only uh, uh, going for egoistic uh, um, uh, objective, but uh, uh, looking also that other people uh, can get uh, uh, something good in when they need. Mm -hmm. And the second model, role model I had in my life is uh, uh, Thomas Sankara, I was 12 years old. He, is, when he was a president. He was a president from Burkina Faso. He changed uh, uh, the name from Old Volta to Burkina Faso, which means uh, the land of uh, honest people. Mm -hmm. And then he was so un engaged. Yeah, he had uh, a heart for people, and he wanted to change uh, the system because there it was a capitalist uh, uh, system uh, trying to exploit uh, 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 African uh, uh, countries. And he said, "No, this have to change. We have to produce for us. We have. We don't need to 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 import." Uh, 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 European thing when we can produce it here and uh, his um, doctrine or his uh, ideal was like uh, he is a Pan-Africanist. Uh, he was a Pan-Africanist because he, he has been killed unfortunately and uh, for him that we had uh, 50 more than 50 countries in Africa if we ha we we help each other right. we can be a, a great uh, uh, continent. Mm -hmm. And uh, it, uh, this message was, was not uh, appreciated from the capitalist uh, uh, countries like uh, America, France, uh, etc. So uh, he has been killed. But um, the ideas he, he left are, uh, are living in us mm -hmm. yeah, because we are the generation uh, who learn about this uh, uh, idea of Pan Africanism, uh, the idea of. Uh, uh, saving yourself, you know, uh, learning to fish, uh, not to, 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 to be there and take uh, a development aid, like a bet, uh, how do you say? Mm -hmm. Begging. <laughs> a begging, mm -hmm. yeah. So this, this gives us uh, um, uh, a new generation uh, now, uh, this, this basis that, that we, we have to, to, to engage ourselves to do things better mm -hmm. than what happened in the past. And would you say now that the African diaspora and Africans are waking up and actually getting engaged and taking control of, of their future and, and the current lives that they're living in? I would say that uh, there, is, uh, there are tendencies, uh, and it's very uh, important to say that, that people are very aware about uh, what is uh, uh, happening in the African continent 
about what has been uh, been doing in the African co uh, continent in terms of uh, exploitation, exploitation of our uh, minerals, exploitation of our, our resources, uh, etc. And uh, 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 people in the diaspora say, no, we don't need it, we don't like it, we know how the market uh, is working, we know how the economy is working. So we are aware, we are aware now, okay. and they say uh, no to the to the system. Now what uh, what we need is an organization, you know, or uh, some organization which are some structure which are really uh, have objective and can work in the long term ba basis to take uh, this uh, change to our countries. And would you say that it is important for the African community to get organized? Because for the, ro uh, because for the longest time we have complained mm -hmm. and we have noted these things and we have been told to do and we know we should do. But do you think that getting organized, getting together and getting organized and putting plans into place, I mean, it happened. You know, um, in Berlin, where countries came together and they planned, they got organized for Africa. Do you think, as Africans, we can also get organized for ourselves? We have to. Yeah, it's very important. It's uh, a survival uh, uh, issue that we get organized, and we um, forget about uh, uh, um, how to say uh, thinking a country to country. Mm. We have to, to get uh, organized, but uh, in the Pan-African uh, way, right. you know, because um, uh, the diaspora is uh, organized, yeah, but uh, what I can notice is that everybody is in his corner and trying to organize some activities and uh, we need to, to, to come together and to put some, uh, some agenda and, and to work for, for that. I was uh, uh, very surprised and, uh, and very happy when uh, I have been uh, invited in Berlin, uh, um, for, no, in M München, uh, there was a Pan-African uh, Congress there. I was very happy and surprised also, uh, positively surprised to see that uh, the diaspora uh, there and also from other countries are really aware right. from what they have to do because we have uh, uh, we have a legacy for from our our um, how to say president like Kwame Nkrumah, like uh, uh, Lumumba, like uh, Thomas Sankara, and we have to keep to keep up uh, with this legacy mm -hmm. for our children and also for the future uh, generation. Mm -hmm. For me, it's very important that we forget about uh, uh, how to say having a good life. It's good. It's very important, you know, yes. but uh, there are some, uh, our con uh, c continent need to be developed. Mm -hmm. So we have to, to wake up now, to come together and to, to ask the real question, to look for the, the, bet the, the best uh, cooperation partner who, who are going to help us to uh, set our agenda. It's very important. Mm -hmm. It is okay for people to look to themselves, live their life, but I think each and every one of us has a purpose. Yes. Each and every one of us should be part of that agenda. Live your life as you wish, but then we have future generations that are looking towards mm -hmm. us. And you cannot be oblivious to that. It will get to you at some point, yes. if not through you, through your children. And it's going to be a very hard thing yes. to, to live uh, through. But coming back to your award, now that you have this award, how do you feel and what do you plan to do with this? Yeah, how I'm feel, uh, I feel, uh, I feel uh, like um, this is uh, a new motivation for me to do better, you know. I, I was not uh, thinking that uh, somebody is uh, checking or looking yes, at my work. Is watching, <laughs> yeah, watching at yeah. what I'm doing. Yeah. But now it's give me also the the, the 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 feeling I have to do to be better. I don't have to to uh, to how do you say yes, to drop up down. something. Yes. Yeah, I have to uh, to be better uh, in uh, in the in the process of realizing the the, the project that uh, we have uh, been realizing be, uh, till now, and um, it's for me also how do we say um, I give the message also to 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 other people. You can make it. Yeah, you can make it. It's not only me. Mm -hmm. 
uh, uh, if you just uh, think that you have uh, energy, you have uh, insight, uh, uh, some, uh, uh, some vision, you can make it. Yeah? Sometimes it does not uh, uh, take a lot, you know. Um, uh, there, are, there, is, uh, there are so many needs in Africa and also here because Baka Baka is not only, uh, uh, is not only dealing with projects in, 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 in Burkina Faso but also here and uh, we have also uh, participated uh, when 2015 when the, uh, the, 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 the uh, migration crisis uh, uh, broke, uh, broke up, we were there to help people. Uh, with uh, warm things, with uh, um, a, a lot of uh, things that so that they can um, have a, a little bit of you know this uh, well-being. You know when you are yeah. in this uh, situation. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it does not need a lot of thing. It needs heart. Mm. If you hear to your heart, you can do a lot of things. Excellent. And what are your words of advice to African women living in the diaspora who have visions, who have missions, who have ideas and want to start doing them, want to get into it? What, what would be your advice? Very raw and very uh, straightforward. Let's meet and let's do things together. Right. This is very important. You know, when you are alone or somewhere in your corner, maybe you don't have all the perspective, you know, right. and you don't have also uh, all the possibilities to to realize your project but if you are together somebody uh, will uh, give you an idea mm -hmm. and then uh, it will be the beginning of a big thing mm -hmm. so for me it's very important that we just uh, forget about uh, our countries our small corners our small sensibilities yeah we have to go together and uh, with respect, yeah, and then uh, 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 speak out what we have like a project and then together we can do great things. I, I believe that women in the diaspora here, they have the energy, they have also the, the competencies, yeah, they ju just need to come together and then to, to put her together to realize yes, a lot of things. We would like to congratulate you, Irene, for this amazing award. Thank we are you. happy for you. Your win is our win, and it is such a great thing to witness. So congratulations once again. Thank you. Radio Africa, Diaspora Colors, Hortensia. We are very proud of you. Thank you very much. I am also what I am because of you, you know, uh, because uh, uh, when, when I hear some uh, uh, suggestion and positive remarks, so I know I, I am all on the right, on the right way. Path. So yeah. thank you also for your support. Excellent. Yes. You're welcome. <laughs> thank you for coming in studio today and we look forward to having you again as always. Thank you very much, Otansia. You've been watching Diaspora Colors for Radio Africa TV. I am Hortensia Moshai.